Right. Vance and Capper daddy -o are up there putting the steel girders on, if you will. Oh, they look nice up there, that's for sure. That sun's got his back lit, but I'll get a picture later on. All right, here we are, Monday, February 13th. Vance and Big Daddy are putting in the stairs. We're putting in the stairs quite well. Quite add. square, quite level. What are these, Ryan? Hickory? Hickory. Hickory. All right, and then they're going to be stained. Clear coat. Oh, clear coat? All right. That's what Charlie said she was. Hey, she's the boss, man, not me. Could be a small miracle right here if them cabinets are here. Uh, we thought they are going to be a couple weeks yet, and Ryan was right if they are here. If they're all, oh no, that's right. These are just the fake cabinets, not the real ones. Disregard. Update on Monday, February 13th. Hardwood should be done tomorrow. However, it's going to be a nail biter as far as preserving the hardwood because Electricians were supposed to have all this done. There's two giant ceiling fans coming down, plus all the lights. So now they have to use ladders, and you know you have the risk of dropping things. So, and then of course then we have all the stone coming for that. So we'll see if it can be preserved without gashes or gouges in it. We'll keep our fingers crossed. But looking good, progress is happening, but there's still some people dragging their feet. It ain't, you know, it ain't Ryan's fault, but some of these guys, this is just down here, Southern Illinois, man. The good ones, there ain't enough good workers to go around. Not cool, not cool. I just startled Ryan again, on accident this time. Ain't <laughs> <laughs> Some baseboards going on. You got to be about done with the trim pretty quick, huh? Just about. Be done tomorrow. A notch in that? Huh? No, wire. Splice them two pieces together. Ah, it looks like a notch. No. I got to do. I And here's the porch. Ryan just finished wrapping these posts with cedar, which they seem to fit much better now for the size. They, they were a little bit skinny before. So that, she's looking good. I don't know. What are you up to, man? When you call me, sometimes I wonder if you're up to no good or if it's legit just a simple question. Today, it's actually just a simple question. All right, My neighbor's doing a prescribed burn. I'm sure that's him. He does them every spring. We got a perfect wind, so it ain't gonna bug us. Very nice. He's really active in managing his property. All right, we have gutters. And we had some issue here with the downspouts, but long and a short story. I was going to tie them into those new drain pipes off of the foundation, but uh, I'm not going to do that. So I didn't really need to dig this out to begin with. I guess maybe I'll close it back up right away while I got that small excavator yet for another hour or two. But anyways, we have gutters. All right, here we are, February 16th. This is the stone, I believe, for the fireplace upstairs. I think it's just for the upstairs. All right, Ryan and the boys are putting metal underneath the deck, which we added 
to combat the water problem we were having uh, in these doors we we're getting a lot of splash water that was penetrating in so the door rep came and changed some panels and stuff but this is just another precaution against the water and there's the pad backfilled and generator sitting on it. Ryan punked me good on this one. I didn't check my level. The forms were level. I knew they were a little bit off. But I didn't check it after I poured it. I actually poured the top soupy. So that it should have leveled on its own. Yeah, well, he told me it was two and a half inches off the level. And I bought into it. Hook, line, and sinker. So, uh, yeah, he got me good. But I'm glad... He punked me because I would have had to report this whole thing. So this mess still is not cleaned up yet because that yellow gas line has to go to the generator and so does a large power line. But soon, soon it will be cleaned up.